You know, hi folks. So where are the seeds in a banana? Well, this here is a bunch of bananas. These are organic bananas I've bought from the uh, supermarket or local store. So let's have a look. These are the Cavendish variety, the commercial variety. We'll have a look and see where the seeds are. So I'm just going to cut into it like so. Peel it back. Actually, I'm going to cut just a section there. And you can see there are not very many seeds. Most of it's pulp. Most of it is pulp. This is the white stuff that you eat. The pulp there. And you'll see the, the little black thing there, believe it or not, that is actually a seed. But it's really a remnant of a seed. They call it a vis vestigial seed. It's only a remnant. It's not the real seed that used to be in the banana. But the real seeds were quite big. And they took up a lot of the space. So after many, 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 many years of crossbreeding, they were able to actually reduce the seed size to just to basically non-existent. And the pulp was mostly in the banana they become very commercially viable but there are other other reasons why they did that as well and some of the reasons were that they were looking for um disease resistant varieties that, that that didn't get plagued by so much by fungus and in that so yeah they do have in a way seeds but they are pretty much non-existent they're so tiny you can there's a black bit there you can barely see them and they won't grow no matter how hard you try, they won't. They will not sprout. The, this is a triploid. There's three genes. The original bananas were a diploid. They had two genes. So please, um, please like and subscribe to our channel. And if you do that, you'll find more information about all sorts of fruits and just facts and figures and information, even recipes. Thanks.